Hey, David Breslow back here with you in today's mental golf training tip video. I want to talk to you about two words, positive thinking. Now every book talks about positive thinking. Most golf pros talk about positive thinking. Almost every golfer I've ever spoken to talks about positive thinking. But there's a myth behind positive thinking. Honestly, quite frankly, it really doesn't work for the majority of golfers that I've spoken to. Why doesn't it work? Here's the problem. Because when you have negative thinking running through you, then you try to be positive. Think of the word I just used, try. If you're trying to be positive, you're already causing a little bit of a mental battle going on at the same time, that you're trying to relax and be comfortable and hit a golf ball. So trying to be positive is just like trying to relax. When I'm working with a client on breathing exercises, let's say, and they're working on relaxing their body so they can have more energy moving through their body and have more power. Energy is power, right? So when I talk to them and they say, and I ask them how they're doing, and they go, well, um, I'm working at it. I'm trying to, I'm working hard at trying to relax. And every time they say that, I start laughing because you cannot work hard and try to relax. It does just the opposite of what you're looking for. Trying to be positive does the same thing. So let's say you have negativity running through you. We all have these negative tapes that we've had for a long time, some longer than others. And what happens is you read a book and you go, oh, hey, that's a good idea. I'm gonna to try to be positive now because I know that's better. And of course, being positive is better than being negative. But what happens is you end up getting into a battle between the two parts of you, the one trying to be positive and the tape that's already playing that has this negative junk on it. So all that happens is you work so hard to try to be positive that you end up being frustrated and you end up not being that positive at all. Or if you are, it doesn't last very long. So here's what I'm gonna ask you to do. Two things. Number one, stop trying to be positive. And how you wanna do that is number one, focus on what you have 100% control over. The moment you do that, you're not gonna be thinking about trying to be positive anymore. Because the moment you focus on what you have 100% control over in this moment, is your mind, body, and emotions will be in sync. They will be in sync. And in that moment, you will be present in the present moment time. Because positive and negative tends to take place when we're going in the past or going in the future. If you try to force it right now in the present moment, you don't ever really get there. And you probably know what I'm talking about by, ex by experience. Point number two, focus on what you want. What is it that you want in this situation? Do you want a more relaxed body? Do you want to hit the ball in a certain particular targeted spot? Do you want to take a particular type of golf swing? Do you want the ball to move from right to left? What do you want internally or externally? What is it that you want? The moment you focus on what you have control over is the moment you'll be able to focus on what you want. Because again, your mind, your body, and your emotions are in sync at that moment. And it's not about trying to do anything. Because once you're in the moment, it becomes effortless. Most of us have had this experience before. We just don't know how we got there. I'm giving you the secret right now. Number one, focus on what you have 100% control of. The second you do that, your mind, body, and emotions will be in sync. And they will be working for you. Then focus on what it is you want. What do you want at this moment? Get clear on that. It won't be any more about positive or negative thinking. It's way too hard to try to do that. And if you've ever tried to do that, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Dave Breslow, glad to be back here with you. Visit me over at www.mentalgolfcoaching.com. And while you're there on the homepage, you'll see a spot for you. If you want to sign up for that free coaching, I'm only doing it for a little while more, up to 30 minutes of free coaching. Everybody who's done it has loved it. So if you haven't done it yet, I welcome you to join us. Uh, again, Dave Breslow, leave me a message here in cyberspace. Would love to chat with you. Take care.